It's about 12.30. Uh, my Delta Pros have been charging since the sun came up. Uh, we can see this one, I am now, you know, 70% charged, getting 440 watts from some pretty dirty panels. I'm gonna go clean them and see how, how it improves. Um, but it's been great so far, it fully charges by, uh, by the time I need to use the batteries at four. One thing I learned is that when you have solar panels laying flat, they get dirty a lot quicker than they do when they're laying at an angle. Yeah, so I just gave my panels a quick rinse off, just the ones that are flat on the patio cover there. It took me a good, you know, just 10 minutes to rinse them off, squeegee them down, and I got a massive improvement from, you know, 450 watt area up to 650 watts. So that's a quite a large jump in production for a quick cleaning. So don't neglect your panels, especially if they're pretty flat and they'll collect a bunch of dirt. All right, so I just gave my panels a quick rinse down and clean off, and that made a big difference. We bumped up from 440 up all the way up to 630 watts coming in. So that was a huge improvement for just a quick 10 minute effort. All right, one last thing before I close out this video, just a, a little plug on calibrating your Delta Pro. Uh, I was disappointed with the kilowatt hours I was getting out of the Delta Pro for the first couple of weeks I was using it with the smart home panel. Uh, I actually got in touch with customer service and they recommended that I fully deplete the Delta Pro all the way down until it shuts off on its own automatically. And then charge it back up to 100% and then deplete it all the way back down again and then recharge it to 100% again. So I did that and my capacity basically doubled. Uh, this is what I'm talking about with uh, getting poor performance on my with my Delta Pros. Uh, this chart shows the amount of power discharged by the batteries over the course of a month. So you can see starting with the 4th up through the 18th, it was only getting, you know, 1.5 kilowatt hours on average there over that time period. And then right there about the 19th is when I did the calibration, 19th and 20th. And after that, you can see I was getting over double, you know, three, between three and four kilowatt hours, uh, depending on the, the demand. Sometimes I wouldn't even use that much between four and 9 p.m. Uh, but this is a good example of you know, showing how valuable the calibration was. Uh, it's been much, much better. Uh, I was, you know, I was considering returning these things if, if I was really only gonna get the capacity I was at first, so. I think it's very important to calibrate your batteries when you first get them uh, to make sure you're getting the full capacity. Um, and that's about it. So hey, if, if you appreciate this video, if you learned something, uh, please consider subscribing. It'll uh, you know motivate me to make more videos as I move forward learning about this uh, smart home panel Delta Pro system. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.